Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to Audio Tips. In today's tutorial, we're going to take you into the Audio Effects folder inside Logic Pro. We're going to open up a, a plugin called Pitch Shifter. I'm basically going to show you guys what it does, uh, give you guys a little bit of an overview on it. This is mostly for beginners, new users uh, to Pro Tools. Uh, we're basically going to get you guys a little bit more familiar with this plugin. So what this plugin does is it basically just changes the pitch of the song. So let's say we open it up on the, uh, on the Flashback Choir. What we're going to do is we can change the semitones of it. So if, if I want to like roll, roll, roll voice, I go into the minus zone. If I want like a squeaky mouse voice, I go into the high zone. So the lower you go, the slower it gets. The higher you go, the faster it gets. Uh, sense is basically just the uh, just the uh, parts of the semitones. Like every every uh, every like uh, fifty uh, sorry a hundred cents is is a, is a is a tone. Um, you guys can switch between drums, vo uh, speech, or vocals, uh, and and this mix button is to see how much of this effect you basically want to go into the that you want to go into the mix with. So if I put on flashback choir, it gives me like a dark, dark sound. You have to be, be careful to stay in key. Uh, this is basically what it does. Uh, play around with it, see what kind of effect you guys can get, and uh, hopefully it will be positive. Uh, thank you guys for watching my video, and please subscribe.